Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video tutorial, we are going to learn about uh, constraint layout in Android. So when we create a project uh, in Android, so the designer file, uh, we have uh, a constraint layout uh, created by default. If I go to this code, now you can see this is uh, an Android X constraint layout dot widget dot constraint layout. Now I'll uh, remove this and I will add the closing tag here. Now inside this uh, this tag we can use uh, uh, and add different widgets. So if I go to design here I will add in some widgets if I drag this uh, text to you. On this constraint layout now you can see if I go to this uh, code you will see that uh, this uh, text view is showing an error because we haven't applied any constraint on this now if I come to design and uh, click on this now you can see this view is, uh, view is not constrained and it only has a design time position so it will jump to 0 0 which means that it will jump uh, here to this corner where my mouse is and uh, uh, if we do not constrain this uh, widget, this text view widget, so come uh, constraint layout work like a uh, relative layout. You constrain uh, widgets uh, related to the parent uh, layout or relatively to another widget. Now, if I want to constrain this, so I will uh, click this and drag this and now it is constrained to top you can see it here you can uh, if I drag this a bit down and now if I press control and uh, break this constraint now I can add the constraint from here as well so I have added the constraint but it took 244 margins from the top because it was at 244 uh, from the top now I'll break this and now I'll uh, apply the constraint from here and now if I go to code you will see that it is still showing error uh, we have constrained it from one side but it is still showing an error now if I go to design again and now if I constrain it from this side as well now if I go to code now you can see the error is gone so we need to constrain at least on a widget to uh, uh, put it or constrain it now if I go to design um, I'll put some margin from here so I'll use uh, 16 so now it is uh, 16 from the top now if I use 100 now it is 100 from the top now you can see it now I'll uh, add some uh, uh, margins here and now I'll drag it to this side and add uh, some margins here as well 24 from this side now we have added three constraints on this widget now I'll go to code and now I'll uh, ch change its text so this is text view constrained from three sides now if I go to design now you can see it here I'll take it to the middle so this is the middle now we will add in another widget so I'll add this button widget now you can see this widget so now I can constrain it to the uh, with respect to this uh, parent layout and I can also constrain it uh, with respect to relatively to this uh, widget now if I want to uh, uh, constrain it to relatively to this widget so I'll constrain it to this widget and now I'll uh, give it 24 now it is 24 dp down from this text view not from this uh, top but from this text view widget 
now I can constrain this side as well to this and this side as well to this so now it will always remain at the middle of this uh, text widget now if I run this on emulator so now the application is running on the emulator and you can see that this button is uh, uh, at the middle of this uh, uh, text uh, view because we have constrained this uh, at the middle of this text view now uh, I will show you what is match parent and what what is rep content so for that we will go to this code you can see this uh, match parent uh, and here as well but we will go to code and I will explain it now you can see that we have this uh, rep content and rep content here as well as rep content here as well now if I make this uh, match parent now you can see that this is the width of the button which is layout width so if I make this uh, match parent so now if I go to design now you can see that uh, this button has expanded to the full width of this uh, uh, parent layout so match parent means that you match uh, with the parent so it's with match matches with the parent right now now if I go to again here and now I'll make this match parent as well so now if I go to design now you can see that it has also uh, taken the complete uh, height of this uh, layout now if I go to code again and now I can give it a pick size as well now if I make this 60 dp and now if I go to design now this is a 60 dp and the height of this button is 60 dp now if I go to code and I make this uh, uh, rep content and now if I go to design now it is wrapped this button now if I go to this code and uh, increase the content of this button to button click the text of this button so if I go to design now you can see that the text increases and the button also the button width increases with it similarly I can add an image view as well and uh, I'll select this one and click OK OK and now I can uh, 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 constrain this relatively to this parent as well as I can constrain it uh, relative to these other widgets now if I want to constrain it relatively to this uh, button so I'll pin this at the top and now I can give it uh, any margin from the top so I'll give it uh, 10 1 0 and now it is 10 down from this button now I can um, uh, now I can pin this side according to parent and this side as well so now this will remain in the middle of this parent uh, this parent uh, layout now if I run this so now the application is running on the emulator but it is not showing up the image so I'll come to this code and now I'll come down here and I'll make this uh, app and now I'll come here to this and I'll make this uh, at map map um, IC launcher round and now if I go to design now you can see this image here and now if I run this so now the application is running on the device and you can see this image at the middle of this uh, parent this one as well and this button as well and this uh, text view as well text widget as well now we have set this uh, button at the middle of this uh, text widget not this uh, parent layout so we will um, move this uh, text view at one side and we will uh, see if this button is moving along so for that I will come to this uh, designer and now 
I'll click on this and uh, as this button is constrained to this uh, text view so it should move with this uh, text view widget so now if uh, I'm moving this text view widget this button is also moving it is uh, keeping itself at the middle of this uh, text view widget now if I run it again so now the application is running again on the device now you can see that it is uh, keeping itself at the middle of this text view because it is constrained to this text view widget so i think that's all for today i hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment thank you